I'm back at Adelaide Airport and I've just seen today's ride come in. It's the beautiful Air New Zealand 787-9. It's only about 18 months old. I'm looking forward to uh, flying this one. It's my first flight with Air New Zealand and only my second ever flight in premium economy. It's direct from Adelaide through to Auckland. Um, it's a beautiful day for flying, so uh, let's jump on board and uh, see what Air New Zealand is like. Welcome aboard Air New Zealand. We know this is going to be a great flight. The premium economy cabin on the 787 is tucked just behind the business class cabin and is laid out in a 232 configuration. There are three rows giving a total of just 21 premium economy seats. On this flight it was fully booked. To avoid filming other passengers some of the footage on this video was filmed as I boarded the return flight back to Adelaide a few days later. I found these seats really comfortable. We were sitting in the front row, which I would recommend because you've got more leg room and they're easier to get out of. Please note that row two and three can be quite hard to get out of the seats when the seat in front of you is reclined. These seats are equipped with a comfortable, fully adjustable headrest and a well padded extendable footrest. Universal power points are located between the seats and a USB socket is located under the entertainment screen. The seats have a good amount of recline and I had no trouble drifting off for a nap. Service started with a warm towel and a glass of bubbly shortly after takeoff. Then it was a drink from the bar before lunch. I went with an old favourite, gin and tonic. Lunch included a set starter, dessert and cheese and three choices for the main course. I chose the paprika chicken with macadamia nuts, it was delicious. My wife ordered a vegetarian meal and it was equally good. I was also really impressed with the bread selection served in premium economy. It would rival anything that I've received in business class. After lunch, I went back and had a look at the economy class cabin, which is laid out in a 333 configuration. Luckily, I found a couple of empty rows, so I was able to try out the seats and film them. I found these seats really comfortable. They were well padded and featured a fully adjustable headrest. The recline was pretty good, and the base of the seat moves forward as you recline, adding to the overall recline effect. Universal power points are located between each seat, and there's also a USB port under the TV screen. Air New Zealand offers three types of fares, seat only, seat plus bag and the works which also includes in-flight meals. The crew on board this flight were fantastic, happy, friendly and engaging, just like all New Zealanders I've met. They gave me a spare economy class meal to film. This was the beef noodle salad. For those passengers on more basic fares, meals and drinks can be purchased using the entertainment system. Back in my premium economy seat, it was time to check out the entertainment system. The system can be controlled via the remote or the touch screen. Noise cancelling headphones are provided. The system was very easy to use and had plenty of choices, including lots of TED Talks. One of the features I really liked was that you can email yourself information on your favourites direct from the system. This aircraft was not Wi-Fi enabled. 
Please note that this was a short daytime flight, therefore no amenities kits are provided. On long haul flights, Air New Zealand does provide them though. In my opinion, the best feature of the 787 Dreamliner is the electronic window shade system. This allows you to still see what's happening outside, even on the darkest position, without irritating your fellow passengers with glare. The windows are also much larger than older aircraft types, so you can really sit back and enjoy the views. This flight had plenty of stunning views, including the iconic 787 wing silhouetted against the setting sun. Sadly, the flight from Adelaide to Auckland was only four hours long, and soon it was time to land. So I put on some New Zealand tunes and enjoyed the views of the Auckland lights on the way in. This was a really great flight. The crew were brilliant and the seat really comfortable. It was a big thumbs up for the catering and the entertainment system too. I would definitely recommend the Air New Zealand Premium Economy and look forward to flying it again in the future. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. If, if you haven't done so yet, please check out my channel where you'll find a whole lot of other flight reviews and more on the way. Also, please don't forget to subscribe. In the meantime, as always, happy travels.